Here we are with uh, Vinny Madalone just moments after a fifth round stoppage defeat to uh, Tomas Adamek. Uh, it was evident early, maybe the first 30 seconds of the fight, that the speed was going to be an issue. Do you think uh, right then and there with that first combination, you probably said speed may be a problem tonight? Yeah, you know, without a doubt. You know, he really quick hand speed. He had real quick hands. And, uh, and that was it. That was the, 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 the finding factor for tonight was his hand speed. Were you encouraged at all? Um, a couple of times you did get through. It seemed like the three or four times you did get through, you may have stunned him, as you said up there. He may have, you know, got his attention. How much encouragement when you did that that, that, that had you going forward in terms of, you know, maybe maybe I can do this tonight? Oh, of course. You know, that's that's what I keep going for. You know, I'm looking for that one punch, you know. And, and that's what it is. I, I'm a, I think I could punch a little bit, and I'm just looking for that one shot. And it could be the 12th round. It could be the first round any time in between. Uh, like you mentioned up there, a uh, couple uh, step-up opportunity. Boyd said Holyfield come up a little short in those opportunities. And you're actually one of the few boxers who's kind of setting yourself up after boxing. I mean, I mean, how many, is it going to take another one, two opportunities, or you said you want to get right back in line? Yeah, you know, listen, this is what I do. My, I am still, my body's still good. I have no injuries. I'm going to keep going. You know, I think i got like another two more years left, and I'm going to keep going. You get one of those six or eight round fights off TV like you've been doing. Maybe That's it. You get a win and come right back and in. Get that, you can probably get that phone call again. There you go. That's exactly what we're looking to do. So. And that's it. Just enjoy the holidays and get right back, maybe in February. Well, you said it. Happy holidays, and I'm sure we'll see you in 2011.